wonderful time for us to enjoy the presence of the Almighty. Yes, uh, we continue with consistence. We continue with consistence. Yes, I just pray that all of us, we are in one spirit and we are doing well and the grace of the Lord is with us. As we continue looking on consistence, um, we know that there are many things many people have failed in life. You know, anything that leads to unsuccessfulness, it is because of giving up failure. And that came through discouragement. And that came through you thinking you cannot make it. Or you work, but you cannot see what you have worked for. Unsuccessfulness comes as a result of different kind of attacks of failure in our lives. But now, consistency is one kind of character that gives us the ability to achieve and to be successful. To be successful in prayer, to be successful in your business, to be successful as a prosperous family that sits together and plans together and do things in one ways. It takes consistency. Yes. Today we can see many people who have heard and we have seen some of us that many people have been so successful in their business career in their business or in their different careers. They have not just worked for a firm, they have ended up opening their own firm, their own companies, because of being consistent and being committed to the work that they are doing everything knowing that they have something that they need to achieve. You must not have bad influence if you want to achieve. You must get away. I know you may be in love with your friend very much. You may be in love with your sister, your brother, your families. But if they are weighing you down, there is no need and reason of you being together. Because now, especially if you start bringing up children on this earth, they need to be inspired by you they need to be carried up by you and you need to know that you are an asset to your nation you are not someone that is just cheap and who can be carried cheap and who can be just come in this eighth and pass like a plastic even a plastic has been used to to, to carry something uh, so you need to know that you are so much important that you need god you need to stand and achieve because the Lord gives us the ability to achieve that which we want. I pray that this morning or this afternoon, this evening, wherever you're getting me from, the words of encouragement shall be in your heart and that you're going to achieve. Remember whatever weighs you down, it is constantly bringing you down. It is constantly, it is constantly constantly so you need to stand constantly to bring it down life is all about competition faith life is all about competition achievement is all about competition the money you want it is it is in somebody's hands the job you want it is in somebody's hands the land you want it is in somebody's hands until you become constantly as uh, as a fighter you become a fighter who fights for the truth I'm not saying do it now in the wrong way because people have gotten that and you want that. No, I'm saying by you doing the right thing, you find out what you wanted, it is in your hands. It will bring itself in your hands knowing that you have achieved and you have done and you have followed the process and the procedure of achieving a life. Yes, I just want to read... Uh, the scripture to you psalms 125 verse 1 psalms 125 verse 1 it says those who trust in the lord are like mount zion they cannot be shaken but endures forever those who trust in the lord are like mount zion which cannot be shaken but endures forever again psalm um not psalm sorry isaiah 40 verse 31 isaiah 40 verse 1 it says but those who hope in the Lord will renew their strength. They will soar on wings like eagles. They will run and not, get, uh, not grow weary. They will walk and not be faint. 
Can you see? So if you fight, if you continue fighting, if you continue moving forward, even the Lord supports you that you shall not be moved, you shall not be shaken. You are like Mount Zion. And again, it renews the strength of those that makes it in life. You can see most of the important people who does a lot of things, especially that touches a lot of community, they don't die easily because God supports them. They are working towards helping humanity, better, bettering people's lives. So I believe in the name of Jesus Christ, you are not going to give up because of someone who was discouraged, because of someone who failed and wants you also to be a failure, want you to be like them. No, 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 we refuse that. We want you to make it and we are standing together for you to be prosperous.